morning guys welcome back to my youtube channel if you're new here my name is ali and don't forget to subscribe down below if you haven't already um but welcome back to another vlog um i'm actually just getting ready it's about eight or nine it's 8 20 um, on a saturday morning i'm getting ready like as fast as i can because i want to go take um some photos with my tripod um the sun just came up i want to do it before um the rest of the city wakes up so people don't like walk by me or see me um i don't know i just don't want to do it when when the city's busy so i'm just getting ready right now and then i'm gonna go and try to shoot um i'm gonna bring two looks probably just do one i don't know i've used my tripod before like in my parking garage and then around my apartment but i've never really gone out in public and used it so we're gonna see how this goes i really hope it works and that like people aren't judgy but we'll see i'm like why did i get an ice and matcha powder that is what i got okay we are going to head out and start driving until i find a good wall um I hope it's not very far though. It's quite cold though. It says it's only 15 minutes to get there. So my look for today is not the puffer, but it is the, you can see it's the brown um, sweater vest. And I just have like leather pants on with it. And then I have this bag. Stuff, but I have this bag with it, and then my second outfit is a Princess Polly one. So, hopefully, these will be successful. It is so cold. So, it was successful, and I got the photos. But, holy, I think I like have frostbite on my hands. Like, oh, this like guy like saw me from across the parking lot and like literally just walked straight towards me. And I was like, oh, this is kind of weird. But I was like, oh, like I want my girlfriend. I was like, hi. You know, he just looks at me and keeps walking. I was like, okay. But now there's like people walking around, so maybe I should leave. But whatever. I'm going to look at them. Car's locked. I'll put the like good ones on the screen, but I really want to take one more, but like I just think it's so cold that I should just go home. This is a good area for sure. Good news, my second oh you can see. Um my second outfit was successful. I hope you can hear me a bit heating. Um and then I just got a Starbucks because we're rewarding ourselves. Or taking our own Instagram pictures. So my go-to order is a caramel brulee latte and now I'm very happy that that's done and um, again we're still in lockdown. I'll show you like where I'm at and kind of like the area I decided to shoot pictures because I didn't show you that. So this is like it's like this really open concept like mall area but like behind it like behind there are like the walls and the stairs and like everything that I was able to take pictures at. Um, I personally like like getting away from the city because where I live is like very congested and there's no open space like this. Like all the grocery stores are really um, close to other things. There's no giant parking lots like this. So if I just drive like 15, 20 minutes out of like the downtown area, then you get like stuff like this and it's a lot easier I find to take pictures. A lot less people, a lot less awkward. Um, so that's my sort of tip on what I do, I guess. But yeah, it's only, I don't even think it's 10 o'clock. It's only 9.30 on Saturday morning and both my photos are done. And I think I might take a few more photos in my home. These guys are watching me talk to myself. So it's just a bit later in the day. I think it's only, it's only almost 11. Um, but I was just cleaning up my apartment from like, um, 
getting ready earlier this morning. I just sort of left in a hurry. So right now I'm looking on Pinterest, um, like ideas to shoot content in your home. Um, so I'm just, so I'm just sort of like playing around with that. I took one picture in my new um, Nasty Gal sweatsuit. Let me show you. Oh, it says Active Society. And this is the sweater. Ignore my messy mirror. Oh my gosh. This is the sweater. And then these are the sweatpants. And I got the sweater in a size large, but I think it's like too big. I definitely could have gotten a size smaller. So it's just like a little more fitted a little less frumpy but then the pants are a size medium and it's so soft and nice and it comes in um red and then i think like a sage green okay i'm gonna do my little unboxing um with you guys now that i said i was gonna do um it's not really an unboxing because i've already unboxed them but i'm gonna show you a few things i got this week so i'll start with the necklace i'm actually wearing it is this like really nice like dainty little chain it's so cute i feel like it's a perfect little addition to any outfit or look so i got that and it's from the same company um that i got this stunning shell candle like look at that so the company is called gold gold and bloom um and they sell jewelry and little accessories like these candles and stuff like that so um all these companies i'm gonna have linked below but this together was one of my first packages then my second package are these stunning candles okay one second i am currently making fries and i think they're burning i'm having um sweet potato fries as a snack just because that's what i'm craving today but anyways, back to these stunning candles. Okay, so these beautiful candles are from a girl I follow on Instagram. Her name is Trinity, but I believe she has like a separate Instagram, but I'm going to link um, both of them down below. But look at these beautiful candles. They're like the bubble candles. Um, this one's like cream and this one's white. I don't know if you can see the slight difference, um, but these are so pretty and they're so aesthetically pleasing and i will probably never burn them because i want them to last forever but i love them so much okay and last but not least nasty gal and i'm not gonna do a try on haul other than my sweatsuit just because i really want to film a nasty gal like haul um with what i got this week and then a few packages or a few pieces i got last week and then if i get anything else i'll put together like an actual like nasty gal youtube haul um but the first thing i got is this sweatsuit that i've already showed but this is it um i think i mentioned earlier it comes in three colors this one a sage green and a red and i got my top in a large and bottoms in a medium which i definitely could have got a medium top the next thing i got is this stunning tank top these are selling so fast because of how like gorgeous they are but look at it it's like a lace um detailing it kind of has the same vibe as like the um scarf tops but obviously it's not a scarf top but it's just so pretty i got this in a size six which i also could have sized down in just the straps are a little long and it's a little loose but i think it'll be okay but it is so pretty they have this in white and they also have it in a black color my next thing is this like argyle print black and white cardigan um i got this in a size medium and i feel like these are really in right now with like the patterns um and the, like the different prints people are wearing as we like slowly almost get to spring but yeah i'm really happy with this and this also comes in a like a sagey sort of like not like a tiffany blue but but like not a green like in between if that makes sense i got these cheetah print flare pants they're definitely really out there and they're different i don't have any cheetah um so i'm excited to see like how and if i can style these um i got these in a size six hopefully they're long enough but they're kind of like a bell bottom ankle but i've seen people like styling cheetah print pants and i'm hoping i can pull it off we'll see <laughs> and then my second pair of pants is these white mom jean style pants that fit really nicely they're really cute um and then the cool detailing is they have like a belt buckle sort of cuff at the bottom just to like slim them up 
I don't know, it's like a cute little like detailing on the end. And then my last piece of clothing is these like boyfriend jeans um, in black. I got these in a size eight, which are too big for me. So these are these really, really nice boyfriend jeans. They're really long. They're kind of like a balloon leg. I don't really know if that's what you call them. It's like a bigger, like wider leg. But the reason I like these is because then it's like a straight down look and they've got that frumpy look. And I feel like it looks cute when you wear these style of pants with like a crop top or like a dainty tee or tank or something like that. Um, so this is what I got. Um, but yeah, we're gonna have to tailor these. But yeah, for the rest of the day, the only plans I have are just going on a walk because it's only like one or 1.30. Um, it's two, but after that, I'm going to go uh, to the grocery store and then that will pretty much wrap up our day. But I think I'll make this vlog into a weekend vlog, so we will hang out tomorrow as well. Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. Um, obviously, it's the next day and it's about 11.30. I have this like makeshift tripod and my cat's going to knock it over. Oh, I just spent the last few hours literally scrubbing my entire apartment, like cleaning the fridge, shower, washing the floors just because it needed it. And thank God that's done. I'm just doing laundry now, but I'm going to make another coffee and we're going to make a smoothie together because I recently got some new products. So like I've said a million times, we're in lockdown here. And I find it so hard to like work out in lockdown or like at home and I also have a tiny freaking apartment So the space is so limited. Um, I honestly really don't like working out right now But I'm trying to like get the motivation and the energy to do so so I bought a pre-workout um, I'll link the website down below but a girl I know she has a fitness Instagram account and she's like hella fit and so um, She recommended this um, it's this high volume pre-workout, um, like supplement that you like put in water before you obviously do your workout. Sorry, I'm just like trying to read this so I can explain it to you better because I honestly don't know anything about like pre-workouts or supplements, but she said this was like a really good one to use just to kind of like give me that extra boost to do like a hit workout or do whatever um, in my living room. And so the thing I really like about this too is it's caffeine free. And she said that there's like no crash and there's no like peak or like where you like get really jittery and like work out and then you like kind of crash at the end. So there's no caffeine, which is really nice. And I've tried it twice and I really like it. I don't do a full scoop. I feel like I should like build myself up to it. Um, but yeah, so this is it. But when I bought the pre-workout, they sent me a whole bunch of like other stuff. So there's like protein for your oatmeal and there's a vanilla protein, um, an amino four, I don't know what that is. There's another type of pre-workout, a sour green apple workout. And then there is a, I don't know what this is, another sort of powder. But obviously I want to try the protein powder. I'm going to try the vanilla protein powder today because because I have such a hard time buying protein powder. I feel like I've talked about this before. Um, and the one I have right now is like okay, but I had it for like a month straight and I just don't really want to have it anymore. So I'm going to try this one and I like that I don't have to drop like $50 to see if I like it. This one comes in a little pack. So, so let's do that together. Uh, okay. Okay, taste test. It's actually not bad. I think I like it because it doesn't taste like the classic grainy protein powder. It doesn't like taste amazing though. I definitely like this, but I probably wouldn't um, buy it because I, for one, am just not a huge protein powder person or a huge smoothie person like I have smoothies maybe like once a week not even so my agenda for the day is I have to film a princess Polly haul um so I'm excited to film that because if I could spend all my money somewhere in the world or only pick one clothing store it'd be princess Polly um so I have to film that today this is a sneak peek by the way um it's such a nice sweater 
and then I also need to get back on my TikTok grind. I am almost out of TikToks. I think I have like three left in my drafts. So I'm gonna do that. And then the Super Bowl is today, I think. I'm not a football person, so. So I might like watch the halftime show by myself, but I don't even know who's playing in it. So the odds of me watching that are very slim. Um, What else did I wanna do today? Oh, I wanted to do my nails. I literally have the world's worst nails. So I actually bought my own poly gel kit, which I will show you today if I do them like the whole set and like how it works. It's like acrylics, but it's not, and you can do it yourself. It's actually really cool. So I'm gonna, sh I'll show you that later today. Um, but yeah, hopefully I can do that. Ugh, maybe I should do that before my haul. No, I won't have time. That's okay. I'm setting you up to like a handheld tripod. Ooh, fancy. It's 3.47 and I just finished filming a YouTube try on haul, which take unbelievably long. And then I filmed, I think about like 10 TikToks, maybe even more. And then I took one Instagram picture and I need to take one more. And then I'm done, but my room, or apartments, a freaking disaster, let me show you. Uh, I mean, I just have clothes everywhere and like moved everything. I have clothes over there and then I was doing all my TikToks. Hi, pee pee. In here, actually it's not like crazy bad, it's just. It's just unorganized and I don't wanna clean it, but. We're gonna clean and then take my one last Instagram and then I think I might make a matcha latte or something because I'm exhausted. What's on your nose? Okay, before I end the vlog, I'm gonna show you guys what I bought that i talked about earlier let me just grab it okay so it's oh i'm not even in the frame um okay so it's five o'clock on sunday and i'm pretty much done everything <laughs> i have to do for the day i just have like editing to do that i talked about earlier but i got all my like shooting of some pictures all done but i wanted to show you um this new nail kit I've got. I've only done it once. Um, I'm probably going to try to attempt it to do it tonight or tomorrow night, but I'm going to show you how cool it is. So, like I said, I love acrylic nails, but I obviously can't get them done. Okay, I need to, like, set you up. This is so hard to do with one hand. Okay, so what I got, it's called Nail Extension Gel. And I think, like, the name on Amazon and, the, like, what other people call it is Poly Gel Nail Kit or something. Um, so I bought this nail kit and then you have to buy the light like the light you put your hand in um, I bought mine separately because this is the only kit I liked with the colors Because it has a whole bunch of neutrals and a white um, And the other kits were like blue and stuff with the light and they didn't sell one with the colors I like with the light so I got them separate look at all the different colors. So we have like clear white pink natural pink dark pink light pink and misty rose um i think clear is like if you want to like paint over top of it my first time i did it, it lasted over a week which is pretty good for like not knowing what the heck i was doing and also i didn't like properly prep my nails um so obviously you should like buff them and like trim your cuticles but this is honestly one of the coolest things i've ever bought um the total of it was like over one hundreds i want to say like 120 um but i think it'd be such a fun like hobby even like after quarantine to like learn how to do my own nails so then i could just do them whatever but that is my nail kit um i don't know if that explanation was helpful i just wanted to quickly tell you about it because i said i would um and then next time i like actually do them and i like get good at it i'll vlog it and like show you how i do it but I'm probably gonna end the vlog off here. My weekend's pretty much done. I'm gonna make chili um, for dinner and 
just hang out but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog like very real in my life i'm sorry if it's not that exciting um but i'm gonna try to like obviously make more vlogs and hopefully do more stuff in them so it's more eventful but thank you so much for watching um subscribe down below like this video if you haven't and i will see you guys in my next video bye